I regret ever trying to open Christina's eyes about you. It was not my place, and you are her father, and she's entitled to those illusions. So I'm not going to make the same mistake twice. Gio finds out the truth about you, it'll be because of something you did. What to tell you, Ava, I don't keep tabs on Sunny Crumbos. You and Joss are so close. Right? And you, you've spent a lot of time with Dex, too. There's gotta be something you've heard that I can use. It's only a matter of time before he tries to revoke our shared custody. He wants to take my baby, Trina. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Ava, but Joss never talks about Sunny. In fact, she avoids the subject. And why is that? She hasn't said. Probably because Sunny and her mom have had so much drama over the years. Joss has never given me details. I'm sorry, Ava. But I'm afraid that the only thing I can do is cover for you at the gallery and run errands for you, but, but I'm happy to do that for you. Okay, well, let me know if you think of anything. One second. Hi, what's going on? Don't look up. What? Why? Ava's got a room overlooking the pool area, and I just left her, and, and she just made me very uncomfortable. What happened? She's wound up about Avery. She thinks that Sonny's going to file for full custody. Just. Okay, look, there's certain things that we just shouldn't talk about, and Ava is one of okay, them. Okay, no, just say what you're thinking. Okay. This is going to sound ironic, but I think that she's better off with her dad. Ava's always been very supportive and loving to me. I consider her a close friend, not just an employer. But the Ava that I've been seeing lately, it's, it's like the one that Spencer used to talk about. Look, if Ava and Sunny go to family court, that's gonna get really ugly. I'm sorry. You shouldn't be dragged in the middle of this. No, I'm I'm staring clear, not even trying to be the go-between. I just feel bad for your little sister. She's the one in the middle. You sure took your time. I am not accustomed to being summoned. I certainly wasn't gonna visit you at the invader's office. I have had a very busy morning. So I hope this covert visit is worth the hype. Now, what do you have for me? What do you know about Natalia Ramirez? She's the mother of that pop star Blaze, right? What about her? Did you get the audio file I sent you? <gasps> yes, but I haven't had time to listen. I just feel like gay people or, or whatever alphabet soup they're calling themselves these days they just they're flighty just not very serious about life like christina and allison just think oh would it be so fun to have a baby as long as we don't have to do any of the hard work or be serious about it you coming or going uh, planning to change and take a dip in the pool and no, I'm just here for work. Ava needed to see the proofs for the announcements for the new gallery opening. You want to see? Sure. I figured it would just say live music. I didn't think I'd be credited by name. You did this, didn't you? Did I spell your name correctly? It's all good. I really lucked out. I... I moved here and I met all the nicest people in town in my first month. Well, I got you a gig at the gallery, but I can't do a thing here at the pool. In other words, I better get back to work, huh? Yeah. I can't do a thing here at the pool. In other words, I better get back to work, huh? Yeah.